Okay guys, what's up YouTube? That is a little day gecko. I'm gonna catch him. Just like this. Quickly. Just like that. Right behind the arms. Lift him up. Boom. Super duper pretty. Day gecko. Look how pretty that is. <laughs> I had to get my camera out quick. Wow, that's really. He kind of feels like a like a tiny grit of sandpaper. Look at that tail, like a dragon. Wow. What is that on my hand? Paint. How did I get? I got paint on me. I'm just gonna give you guys a better look at him. Maybe it's not the best idea to lay on my stomach. But that right there is truly just crazy. These aren't like rare, but well, they're all uncommon to catch. And uh, anolis, you could catch them at day or night. But these are only strictly out on night. Um, they're nocturnal. They eat moths. So that's why I really don't want to hurt this guy because he is very good for the environment. He'll eat kissing bugs, all the stuff that give you diseases. Well, he doesn't have any diseases, but he eats stuff that's deadly to humans, but not to him. And he really feels like a fine, super fine grit of sandpaper. And as you can see, he's only about four inches. Uh... He's super duper pretty though, as you can see, he blends in very good, but he was in the screen door. And if you guys would like to see, uh, let's see how fast he is. Uh, let's see, he's going to zoom, so I need to back up far. There he goes. Oh wait, <laughs> yep, there he goes. Right underneath there, so I need to. Oh, nope, there he is. Can you guys see him? No. Well, yeah, he's gonna eat, you know, bugs and stuff, so it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. I was gonna let him go anyways, but it's better for me to let him go in here. So that, uh. Oh, wow. I just had to cover up the light because it's bright. Usually there's like baby ones over here. Well, let's go and see. No. Nothing's ever rarely out here. But I did catch my corn snake right here. Make sure I'm not stepping on anything. Right here. His tail was right here. And he was crawling up into this little groove. I'm guessing to eat lizards. Uh, corn snakes, they usually eat lizards, mice, anything that could catch in the wild. They're in the rat snake family, but they are very close to rat snakes. As so far as um, looks and stuff like that. That's mainly it. And they kind of eat like rat snakes a little bit. Kind of. And there's always a day gecko around here, up in these plants and up there, mainly on roofs. Like there's one that hides there every single night, but now that I'm looking for them, he's just not going to be out here. He probably got spooked. But yeah, there's, there is not a shortage of them down here. Usually I found them around like five out here in the nighttime later than this, about eight o'clock. No, not eight, about like 10. I'd be walking around. Currently the time is 9.34 in Florida right now. I should be looking at my feet, but it's kind of weird to be pointing my camera at my feet. 
But yeah. And if you're wondering why I have these stuff here, snakes, lizards are under there. Oh wow. There's actually a slug right there. And a small baby earwig. I just covered that up because I don't know if some people are sensitive to spiders, nothing. But trust me, whenever I say these things are pretty cool, they're pretty cool. Also, have this. Nothing's going to be under here. I already checked these today, but I always check at nighttime too. Maybe something ran under it. Let's check under this one. No. Of course not. What am I talking about? Anything on the chair? No. I've never found any on objects, only on the house and stuff like that. Check the surroundings. Let's see. Yeah, nothing like I thought. Yeah, but they're not going to be really out in the open. They blend in very well. They do make it really hard for you to spot them. I just think that's because they adjusted to seeing humans, they gain speed, you know, invisibility it seems like, but it's just blending in as I showed you that one. They have this sort of grittiness and texture that feels really nice. It feels almost like carpet, almost, but not as fluffy. Like, just think of a, think of a really not shallow like shortly cut carpet that's what they feel like exactly what they feel like actually <laughs> yeah but that one I found is gone he jetted off he might actually be on the wall of this no there's no way you guys are going to be able to see him he's gone but that's okay because we really already showed you him. And that's basically that's out at night. Well, not basically. There's more stuff. But there's less than more. There's only like bugs, certain lizards that are out. Um, we have Cuban anoles, brown anoles, regular anoles. Like there are a whole bunch. Like morphs and stuff like that. And one day I will show you guys those. We have skinks. I think salamanders. I'm not sure. I don't really know the specifics, but I do know a little bit about it. Oh, wow. I can control the brightness. Let's turn that down a bit so you guys aren't getting blinded. Well, we'll turn it up that way. Anyways, um, we have skinks, new, not newts. I don't really know about newts or amphibians that much, but I do know we have a lot of diverse reptiles, alligators, crocodiles, and then... We don't have seals down here, that would be super cool, but, you know, there's, like, amusement parks with animals, stuff like that. And, I mean, I'm sorry for not posting in a long time, I think it's been, like, about two months now, but I really had no content to post, really. Um, my life has been pretty boring over the past two months. I've been trying to find some content, I did go to the beach, so, if you want to see that, I'm going to be up, you'll... Upload, uploading, <laughs> uploading it. Um, and also, I'm, I hope to make a video of a river. Of a river, I might go out there and show you guys the uh, armored, armored catfish. They're really cool. And uh, what was I saying? They're uh, pretty cool. Let's see if there's anything on there. Oh my god. Alright, I gotta be very slow and very careful. Hold on. Let me go back to the, the house really quickly. Two seconds. And get something to catch this with. Right, that, that's pretty loud. catch it with um it's gonna be pretty fast but um let's see 
Maybe I could just record it and keep it in its natural environment. Maybe I could do that. I might have to do that. I can't. I'm not gonna open that just for it. Is this okay? Oh. That's not. Alright, well, I wanted to show you guys something, but unfortunately, it is going to be too loud, too hard for me to find it. There might actually. No. Alright, this is a warning. If you don't like cockroaches, look away now. Skip like f a couple minutes. But here, without further ado, let's make sure there is none so I don't get a surprise crawl on. But without further ado, here it is. Trigger warning. And that is what um, Floridians call palmetto bug. When they come into your house, I hate them so much. I have a phobia of them. They're really creepy. And I do not like them at all. Oh, there it goes. And for all of you that are saying, let it crawl on you. Not. <sighs> oh, wow, look at that huge moth. Kind of sidetracked, but anyways, let's look at it. You know what? For 10 subscribers, let's do this. If it does crawl on me. I hate these so much. Ooh. I am so scared. Oh no, there it goes. Oh, wow. Do you guys not see how big that is? That's not your average roach. That's huge. Look how fast it's running. Snakes will eat it. Anything that likes roaches, you know? And when I say anything, anything, like these things will get murked. And this is a male. This is a male because he has wings. Females are smooth and they don't have wings. Let me show you it more. It's really freaky. Move. Move. That is creepy. That is creepy with two E's. Wow. That is a good find for tonight. There's big moths hitting me because they fly pretty close to your face. And as you guys can see, I am barefooted. I don't really care. It's not that I don't even have shoes. It's just I prefer being... Not I don't prefer, but it's pretty cool not having shoes on. Oh, wow. I saw the shadow of that, I thought it was another. Pretty cool. Let's see where he goes. I want him to stir that way, because that's where the house is. Wow, look how he just blends in like that. If I were a predator, I would never be able to see this guy. Let's see. Yeah, he's going in that super tall grass. There he goes. Let's see if we can get him this way into the thinner grass. This grass is pretty large. So you guys can get a better, you know, look of him. I'll get a close-up shot. Um shout out to my classmates, man. I st I really start this for my class, really. YouTube. So, you guys can see what I'm doing. It's pretty nasty what I'm doing right now. But these are relatively clean. They don't really they don't really have, oh, what the, oh my god, this is why you also do have to have shoes on, but you know your boy, he's reckless, I'm getting bit up by mosquitoes, but look at that, that is a giant wolf spider. I can't get my phone too close, but I'll try and zoom in, ow, getting bit up by mosquitoes for this, oh my god, he's gone, he just disappeared, but here's the roach, and, oh, there he is. That is creepy. You're actually supposed to kill those. Those kill a lot of people. And that is the most creepiest, most ewest thing besides that. I'm not really scared of spiders. But that right there is the equivalent to a tarantula for me. Oh my god, I'm getting bit up. 
just give you guys one more look. Now, let's move on to this spider. Uh oh. There he is. Hi, Mr. Roach. Hello, Mr. Spider. Man, dude, this thing is huge. Can you guys even see it? It's right there. Right there. Ow, just got bit by a mosquito. Alright, I think that's enough for me. Uh, mosquitoes, one last look. Wow. You know what? Skip it. It's not going to kill me as long as I keep my hands a long distance away. It blends in so well, just like the roach. Yeah. That's enough for me. <laughs> That's my call to go. My cue to go. Yep, I'm done. <laughs> I'm getting bit up and stuff. If I find a gecko, I'll come back out. But, uh, your mans don't want to die today. Actually. Oh, my God. Where was that at? That was just on me. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, that just jumped off of me, guys. Oh my god, do you guys see the little glowing eyes? Oh my god, I'm so lucky that did not just bite me. Please tell me that did not just bite me. Oh my god, I'm gonna pass out. Oh my god, please don't tell me that bit me. It did not hurt at all if it did. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh my god, I have to creep you call it. <laughs> if you don't get how serious this is to me... Like, I'm, I'm going to kill that thing in a minute. But, I'm so sorry I had to kill it. I left it, but it must have got on me. I did not feel it at all. It must have jumped on me or something. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Was that on my phone? I stepped on it. I felt it. I felt something, like, squishy underneath my foot. I must have stepped on Oh, my God. That's so gross. Oh, my God. If you got this far into the video... <laughs> Did you guys see it jump on the camera? Oh my god, bro. That scared me so bad. I have to kill it. I have to kill it. Did it bite me? I'm just going to give you guys a fair warning. That that gecko that I let go eats these spiders. Oh my god. Can you guys see the little glowing eyes? Yes, you guys can. Oh my god. Oh my god. My feet feel so weird. I need to wear shoes more than I do this. I swear I do. I'm actually going to take my shirt off, but... Oh my god, do you guys not see the eyes? That's a spider. Do you guys not? That's my hand. That's a spider far away. I'm going to kill that thing. That's an adult. Now the babies, they're smaller. I'll show you guys them another night. But oh my god, that creeped me out. So, so, so bad. Like you guys don't even know. Actually, I'm going to kill it now. Like when I mean now, I mean now, now. That thing can potentially hurt somebody. That's how bad that thing is. Look at it. Look at that thing. That is dangerous. And if it bit me, guys, that's going to be bad for me. And if that thing was on me, I'm going to make that the most painful kill that you guys have ever seen. No, I'm just kidding, guys. I'm going to put it out of its misery. I'm not going to torture it or anything. But I do feel very weird. Oh, my God. I'm crawling. You guys see me keep lifting up my leg and scratching? I feel so... Itchy and disgusted. Stay there. Do not come any. Come here. Come. Run to me. Run to me. Run to me. Run to me. What is it? I'm serious. Run to me. Straight to me. Come on. Straight what to is me. It? <laughs> Go. No, is it a spider? Yes. Run. Ru T. Run, please. Run. Run. I'm All right. Go around. Go around. Yeah. 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 Guys. That. T oh my god, it's moving. I need to kill it fast. I need to kill it. I'm gonna use this bottle. I'm gonna sneak up on it. Oh no, I missed. I missed. Oh no. Oh I got it. Oh my god, I'm so sorry you guys had to watch that. There's another one. Where? <laughs> T don't play. Oh my god, I killed it good though. Make sure it's dead. If it crawled on me, I'm gonna Ooh T! <laughs> T, I'm gonna. <sighs> Don't do that. From? It was on me. I was in the house and it jumped off of me. <laughs> I'm killing it. 
die. That's all that's left of it. No, 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 don't tell her. Don't tell her. Well, guys, I'm gonna end it right here, guys. You just... <laughs> I'm so sorry that ended up... This video ended up in the wrongest way possible. That is so disgusting. Ew, 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 ew. Did it bite me? Yes. I am that miserable. I have to look at it through my phone. Oh my god. I'm gonna I'm gonna die. I just can't right now. I need to just keep walking. I feel so dirty and nasty. Oh my god, imagine if the roach crawled on me. I I wouldn't even have been scared because I know roaches, palmetto bugs, they don't bite. That thing is seeking for blood blood. He wants blood. Well, without further ado guys. This is the blue this is the blue crawfish. Over. Over and out and signing out for now. Peace. La peace.